Let's just keep this quiet as long as we can. We have company. All right, everyone. Spread out. Hang on. Close. 
Oh, great. That's a lot of them. You all right? Fine. Just thinking of all the ways that could have gone better. See, I'm thinking about how it could have gone worse. Much more positive outlook, sort of. Okay. Let's go find our giant water faucet. Sounds good. What's this? Don't know. Seen a few of them around. Okay, that's not it. No, this. What's the trick here? What? Look like a button. Yeah, I just wanted you to have a go at something. Here goes nothing. That's a good sound. One of the spokes on the wheel just turned around. about you. That's two. Found you. Only one left. Last but not least. <coughs> that should do it. Okay. Back to the big wheel thing. <coughs> big wheel thing? Whatever the archaeological term for it is. Mm, big wheel thing works. Looks like we're going under. Radio. Right 
There's our faucet. One trident coming up. Oh, what the hell? That's not fair. Ganesh? Hello, sir. Come on, let's get this over and done with. Yep. Whoa! Shit! See? I told you it was dangerous. You hurt. Just my dignity. <sighs> Here we go. There'd be water. Now that's three. You know, you're pretty good at this whole treasure hunting thing. I'm a quick study. Mm. One question, though. I reckon that you could pretty much do anything you want. Why are you so keen to get Shoreline back? Seriously? Mm. My partner tends my own men against me. My lieutenant makes off with a bounty. Nathan and Samuel Drake get off scot-free and you're asking why I want Shoreline back. Yeah. It was on my watch. I lost it on my watch. What the hell is that thing you keep playing with? It's my stress toy. It showed up in the mail a few weeks after we got to Australia. All right, we better get a move on. We don't want a salve to get ahead of us. You know, I've had my fair share of screw-ups. <laughs> you just pick yourself up and move on. I don't like to fail. No one does, no. Right. All right, let's find a way out. Last one back to the car buys dinner. I brought MREs. You're no fun. Fraser, incoming reinforcements. Oh, figures. Hello. Brothers, where are you? Go 
going over there! Hurry up! Take it down, Lord! Come on! All right, we're clear. For real this time. You handled yourself on. All things considered. What things are those? No real combat training. Ah. Slightly impulsive. Run around the field like a maniac. Need to learn what short, controlled burst means. All right. And lost. Wearing red in a jungle combat scenario. I mean, seriously. I think we're done out here. I'm heading. Yeah. Look, for what it's worth, your kick-ass reputation that got you this job. Plus, I figured you could use the money. You're not wrong. Honestly, though, it's actually nice working with a woman for a change. <laughs> Too rot. Not many of us out here. This one arms dealer demanded to speak to the man in charge, then tried backing out when I informed him I was running the show. Ugh, what did you do? Broke both his legs. <laughs> oh my god. You're not kidding. Just trying to level the playing field. Oh, don't cross Ross. <laughs> I should put that one on my business card. 
Can't you just walk away to be done with shoreline? I was born into it. I don't have a choice. Oh, there's always a choice. I'm just going to take a look around. Yeah, I'll keep an eye out. Thank you for your indulgence. Take a look around. Do what you have to do. Thank you for your patience. Shall we? Right behind you. Magnificent. How long do you suppose it takes to carve something like this? Years. Decades, even. Hoy Salah certainly did have a knack for stonework. And the war, it seems. That too. They must have 
made these to commemorate their victories against the Persians. Looks like they put up a good fight. They did. Pity it didn't last. But their loss is our gain, right? That carving looks familiar. That carving is an exact match for the disc. So what does that mean? I don't know yet. But, I'm guessing, we should give that a try. Should we dance? Try not to break it this time. Sassy. Mm. You ready? Yeah. Just, um, taking it all in. Oh my god. <sighs> Welcome to downtown Halabadoo. The last known resting place. Task of Ganesh. Spectacular. <sighs> hmm. What? Doesn't it look like there's a dam or something between the two Ganesh statues? It must have been eroded by the falls. So how do we get in? Look at the crown. It's not wear and tear. You're right. Maybe it was a watchtower. But that's how the Persians got in. I have heard about this place for so long. <laughs> I can't believe I'm actually looking at it. Take a picture. Send it to your dad. Great idea. What? You're one of those cultures who can't work a computer? Just take the picture. Show it to him in person then. No, it's uh, just a few decades too late for that. Look, I'm. Oh. Oh, God, please, no. That's fine. Shall we, uh, head over to Halibadoo? <laughs> 